Three months after Embraer delivered a legacy 450 to its first European customer, the aircraft was approved for operations at La Molle Saint-Tropez Airport in the southeastern corner of France. The near-sea level airport has significant operating restrictions in place due to mountainous terrain and unusual weather conditions. Aircraft, both charter and owner-operated, must be able to stop within 60% of the runway. And recently increased measures mean that aircraft once able to land there are now restricted. That's why winning approval for the Legacy 450, which is now the largest mid-sized jet that can operate into the airport, was a big deal for both Embraer and Smartair, the company that manages the aircraft. It was also a key requirement for the owner of the jet, so the certification process began soon after its arrival into Europe. Not long after certification was granted, Aviation Week was invited on a demonstration flight to see firsthand the full performance of the aircraft. With Cedric Gerdand, Smartair's chief captain, in the left seat, the cabin was prepared for auto brake high. We were fully strapped in, ensuring no loose items were left in the cabin. stopped in 400 meters after the nose gear touched the ground, 200 meters after the threshold, taking under 10 seconds. Godin told us he would normally land at auto brake medium for a more comfortable passenger experience. This Legacy 450, serial number 3, is currently the only one in Europe, and it's the only mid-size currently available for charter into Saint-Tropez. Smartair is expecting it will prove popular for charter flights during the busy summer season in the region.